Welcome to this tutorial on Mastering Index Match and VLOOKUP in Excel. If you are tired of manually searching of amount of data to find the information you need, this tutorial is for you. These two powerful functions, Index Match and VLOOKUP, allows you to easily retrieve data from multiple tables with just a few simple formulas. In this tutorial, we will be using two tables. Table number one contains invoice number and customer ID, and table number two contains customer ID and customer name. Our goal is to use these two functions to easily and quickly bring customer name from table number two into table number one. So, let's start. First, let's take a look at the VLOOKUP. VLOOKUP is a function in Excel that allows you to look up a value in one table and return corresponding value from another table. So let's type in our function equals VLOOKUP, open brackets. The first argument in the function is lookup value. The lookup value is a value you want to look up in the first column of the table array. In our case, it would be a customer ID in table 1. So let's choose cell B3. The second argument is table array. Table array is a range of cells that make up the table you want to look in. In our case, it will be table number 2. So let's select column K to L. Third argument is index number. It is the column number in table array, which is table number 2, from which the matching value should be returned. So in our case, it would be column number 2 because the customer name is located in the second column of table number 2. Range lookup is a logical value that specifies whether you want VLOOKUP to find an exact match or an approximate match. If you set this value to true, VLOOKUP will find an approximate match. But if you set it to false, VLOOKUP will find an exact match. In our example, we need an exact match, so we will type false. Now close brackets and hit enter. And we see that VLOOKUP brought us customer names from table number 2 to table number 1. Now just autofill it down and you got all customer names in seconds. This function is super useful and it's so convenient. It's one of my favorite functions. Now let's take a look at index match. Index match is another function in Excel that allows you to look up value in one table and return corresponding value from another table. However, unlike VLOOKUP, index match allows you to look up value in any column of a table, not just the first column as a VLOOKUP. First, let's break down our index match into two functions, index and match. Let's take a closer look at the match function. The match function is a function in Excel that allows you to find a relative position of a value in a range of cells. So here, if we will type equal match, open brackets, lookup value is a value you want to look up. So we're looking for customer ID, which is F3. Lookup range is a range of the cells that contain the lookup value, which is customer ID. So in our case, we will select column K, which is customer ID column in table number two. Match type is an optional parameter that specifies whether you want to find an exact match or approximate match. Zero is for an exact match, so type zero. Now just close brackets and hit enter. And match formula will tell you the position of the customer ID in this list. In our case, it returns number 3, which means the customer ID we're looking for is the third item in the column K. So just like counting, if you look at the column K, you will see that this customer ID is indeed the third item on the list. 1, 2, 3. 
Now let's take a look at index function. The index functions allows you to return a value from specified range of cells. So let's type equals index, open brackets. The first argument is return range. It's the range of the cells that contains the value you want to return. We want to return customer name, which is column L. So let's select that. The row number is the number of a cell you want to return. Because we already did match function, we know that number we want to return is number 3. So let's select H3. Now close brackets and hit enter. And you see that index formula returns the name of the customer from the range of cells. And it tells us that the name of the customer in row number 3 is Peter Pancake. Now the last step would be to combine index and match functions to create the index match formula. When we combine these two functions, we can look up a value in any column of the table, not just the first column like VLOOKUP. So let's type equal index, open brackets, return range is column L, customer name, we already know that. Now put comma and we will insert match function. So type match, open brackets, lookup value is F3, comma, lookup range is column K, which is customer ID, comma, and the match type is zero for exact match. Now close your brackets, hit enter, and you'll see that the formula returns the customer name from the same row where the customer ID is located, which is row number three. Now double click to autofill formula down and you will get the customer names for each customer ID. Index match is useful because it allows you to look up a value in any column of the table, not just the first column like the VLOOKUP. Try these functions yourself and compare which one you like more, which one fits best your management needs. And let me know in the comments.